He was their only son. Our grandparents mourned the rest of their lives. I still remember the grieving and the sorrow, and that passed down to the three of us grandchildren, even though we weren't born yet. People don't understand how sorrow and grief like this can affect children. It was a part of our lives. And my earliest childhood memories are of hearing about him. The hardest thing, and this is why uh, they mourned so much, and so did we, was because we didn't know what happened to him. He left on a training mission with his crew one night uh, in the South Pacific and didn't return. We grieved, we, we mourned as well, and it, it hurt us so much to see our grandparents in such sorrow. And so we've carried that, and I think people don't realize that when one of our servicemen or women is missing and there isn't closure, it, it just doesn't stop the grieving and the mourning and the sorrow. You have to know what happened to them. He's always been a part of our lives, and, and I just thought, I'm going to Google his name and see if there's anything on the Internet about Uncle Laverne. And it was miraculous. His squadron was looking for the members, for uh, relatives of Laverne Lolithan, as well as the members, uh, or family members of the other crew. Now these guys were all in their 80s and 90s, and they were still working to try to get these guys home. And that's when I first realized really what leave no brother behind, leave no man behind really means. They weren't gonna give up. I had never heard of JPAC until we heard from the squadron and they told us about wanting to, JPAC to go, go to the crash site. And the phone rings and this woman from the POW MIA office proceeded to tell me that the remains of the crew of my uncle had been retrieved and identified and they were on their way home. And I just, I can't tell you what that meant. It brings back memories of how, how hard this was for my grandparents and my mother and the three of us grandchildren. That was our whole family, that was it. Knowing meant the world, it means the world. Why is it worth all the time and expense to go after these fallen? They gave their lives for our country, they are they would be veterans if they were still alive. Uh, we honor our veterans, uh, we honor our fallen, but we can't forget about them. Uh, these families, are, there are tens of thousands of families still hoping to get the news. I want everybody to know about JPAC. I want to support it in every way I can. I want, I'm going to order the POW MIA flag. I'm going to give flags and decals and things to every, you know, all our family. Um, I think people need to be aware.